so today's video is going to be a first impressions video. I'm really excited about this because I've been on the hunt for these for, I feel like, over a month since I heard about them, and I couldn't find them in California. I went to North Carolina, I went to Ulta, and they had them there, so I picked up the two that I was wanting, and I haven't even said what they are. These are the NYX Liquid Suede Cream Lipsticks, and I got two very untraditional colors, but hey, that's just what happened. So I got the colors Sway, which is a purple color, and I also got the color Stone Fox, which is a grayish color. I don't know why I wanted these colors. I think because the swatches I saw, these two were the most like <gasps> to me. Well, I know why I got the purple one because it looks like my favorite NYX high voltage lipstick. I brought this out so I can swatch them to see them side by side, but I've wanted these for a long time, and I'm so excited, and I promised you guys I would do a first impressions, and I haven't even opened these. Like, I've been a really good girl. Like, I haven't cheated. Like, I know nothing about these. I love the packaging. There's, like, a little gem in the top. You'll be able to see it in the close-up. Little black diamond gem. And, uh, yeah, I like that the tubes are the colors of what is the lipstick is gonna be. So that makes it easy to find in your bag or your drawer. So, let's open them and get started. Cracking the seal. Ooh, first thing is the smell. Hmm. Doesn't really smell like much. I'm gonna swatch it on my hand. Look at that color. Oh my god, it's amazing. That is a very vibrant lavender. This might make my teeth look like really yellow, but we'll try. <laughs> now I want to swatch my NYX High Voltage Lipstick in Play Date next to it to see how it compares. Mmm, not so much. So <laughs> I was a little off, but hopefully I'll still like the lavender one. And now we're going to swatch Stone Fox on the hand. Oh my gosh, so fun. I wish I had the balls to wear this kind of color outside of the house all the time, but I just don't. But I feel like for the month of October for Halloween, I can get away with it, so I picked it up. But it's a really nice dark gray color. Like, I want this in a nail polish. <laughs> so don't mind the middle swatch. They swatch really nicely. Let's read about them. Doll up your lips in plush and vibrant color. Our liquid suede cream lipstick glides on and sets into a striking matte finish. Velvety soft and waterproof, this long-lasting lippy creates a positively polished look with every swipe. I'm gonna try one without a lip liner and then I brought a lip liner to try with the purpley one just to see how they differ if it can get away with no lip liner and whatnot but um, we're gonna try it without first so let's zoom in and get started I'm so nervous I don't know why these videos make me so nervous but they do <laughs> so let's zoom in and let's let's do it hey guys this is very close up of my face makes me a little nervous <laughs> so gonna try stone fox first so wish me luck because here we go I um I put on chapstick like before I did my makeup so there's like a little moisturization but not a whole lot so looks kind of scary to just apply it with this why am I so nervous <laughs> that's going on quite nicely mind focus I hope so I'm also terrible at applying things with the lip gloss applicator, so that doesn't help. I really like this color though. It feels so nice. It's always hard to get like a clean line on my top lip because I have barely any top lip. That works. <laughs> I feel like I was not in focus for that whole thing. I apologize. So far, I love the way it feels. I love the color. I love the way it went on. My issue that I always have with liquid lipsticks is this right here, it traveling out, which is why I wanted to try one with a lip liner to see if that helps at all. What I have to compare these two are the Bomb Meet Matte Hues, which I did a whole like lip swatch and review on. I'll link it right up here, but these are much cheaper and kind of a little bit different in the fact that they have more vibrant, fun colors. Um, there's obviously not this kind of color in the Bomb one that's more like reds, pinks, nudes, and so far they're just as good. They almost kind of feel a little bit better. The Bomb ones do have like a pepperminty feel that I like, but these don't like offend me in any way. So, I love this so far. Same as the Bomb ones, I think that these dry enough to where they're not going to move and especially they're not going to get on your teeth which is what I really like about liquid lipsticks that dry matte because I have really big teeth and if you know lipstick gets on them it's a mess so it's nice I mean for anybody it's nice to have no lipstick on your teeth and not have to worry about it once it's set and dry but it doesn't dry too much to where it's like um I mean I guess it is settling into my lips a little bit but I kind of really that happens with everything just because I think I have lines in my lips but they're not like really creeping in there i will say i watched jacqueline hill on snapchat of course i rolled my eyes at myself <laughs> but she says what she doesn't like about liquid lipsticks is this 
when you can see that inner rim, she says it looks like a butthole, and I love it, and I totally agree. Okay, so that is this one, which I love, and I'm gonna wear it as much as I can this fall, but let's take this off and put on the purple one with a lip liner and see if it makes any difference. I started taking it off. That looks really good. Looks like I have a mustache. <laughs> okay, anyway, I started taking it off and I thought I should film this so that they can see how easily it's coming off because it's really coming off very nicely. To, I haven't had it on very long, but... That went pretty smoothly for essentially a black lipstick taking it off, so A plus for that. Okay, now I'm going to line my lips. I have this Universal Beauty For Real lip liner that I got in a BoxyCharm, but I'm just gonna line them real quick. Just a little, little line. I'm testing it out so you don't have to. I like that slogan. Now we're going in with Sway, Sway. Let's do it. I'm excited and nervous. Excited and scared. Okay, matches the mirror a little bit. Okay, here we go. Oh my God, this was much more vibrant than anticipated. Oh my God. I feel like it's instantly making my teeth look yellow. So far, I don't think the lip liner is making a huge difference because it wasn't that hard to apply without it. This color just goes on so nicely, like so vibrant in one swipe. The bomb ones, why am I trying to talk and do this at the same time? A lot of the bomb ones, they, they are a different concept. They're not like bright, vibrant colors for your lips, but the bomb ones, a lot of them took two coats to like kind of get to the color you want. This is like one swipe and you're there. Ooh, overlined on that side. This is very bright. <laughs> Yeah, instantly yellow teeth, just instant. Like there's no saving it. So this is nice if like, you're gonna keep your mouth shut all night, but you're not going to probably. Okay, so this one has dried. Say so it's pretty much the same. I'm just not as crazy about this color because I'm just a little too pale for it. And it makes my teeth look yellow, but I like these. I especially like the Stone Fox one a lot. I'm gonna wear it as much as I have the balls too. But um, I'm gonna give these an A. I think they're really nice for the price point. I like them a little bit better than the Bomb ones um, as far as color payoff. And um, these ones don't bleed out as much. So maybe, I, I'm not even quite sure. I think they have some reds. So maybe I'll try like a vibrant red or there's like an orange orange that would be fun so I don't know I might pick up more colors and not wear this one because it obviously doesn't suit me but um, it is a nice it, the color payoff is amazing is what I'm trying to say I like the way they dry matte but not too dry to where they're drying out your lips but dry enough to they're not getting all over your teeth and the price is right I think they're six dollars either five ninety nine or six ninety nine please hold let me check they are six ninety nine so they're seven dollars essentially and I love NYX I've said it once I'll say it again I love NYX a lot uh, yeah let me know if you guys have tried any of these which colors you think I should pick up if you have down below in a comment I'm gonna go take this off and uh, yeah I love you guys I'll see you very soon I hope you have a great day and subscribe for more. Subscribe yeah. right here. Subscribe, subscribe. Okay, now that you think I'm crazy, I'm gonna go. I love you guys. I'll see you soon. And I already said that. Okay.